In this video, we're applying the ratio test to this series to find out whether or not it's convergent. So what you do in the ratio test is you investigate the large n limit of the absolute value of the next term in the sequence divided by the previous term. So the n plus 1 term divided by the n term. If that limit turns out to be less than 1, you have convergence. If it turns out to be bigger than 1, you have divergence. If it's equal to 1, it's inconclusive. So let's look at this ratio and take the limit. So my n plus 1 term is going to be n plus 1 over e to the n plus 1. I then divide that by the nth term, which is the same as multiplying by its reciprocal. And then I take the large n limit. Notice the absolute value bars weren't necessary because all these terms are positive anyway. Okay, well, I could write e to the n plus 1 as e times e to the n and cancel out n factors of e. So those are gone. And I'm left with the limit of n plus 1 over e times n. I could pull the 1 over e out in front and then divide each of these terms by n, and I end up with a 1 plus a 1 over n. The 1 over n unambiguously goes to 0, and I'm left with just a 1 for the limit with that 1 over e out in front. Okay, e is a number bigger than 1, so 1 over e is less than 1. Therefore, our series converges.